In this video, I'm going to explain how to update your material prices. In Red Rhino, once a month, before the fifth of the month is our goal, people go in and update prices. Now, I say people. We have programmers that do all that. They grab the pricing online somehow. I don't even know how they do it. But they they uh, update the material prices for commodity items that we have pricing for in Red Rhino. I'm going to show you how to change that. Now, what happens is a lot of times, or let me say it this way, a lot of our customers get pricing sheets, some of them call them hot sheets, from their wholesalers, okay, from their uh, vendors or their suppliers. And those prices, or, or I should say those, those pricing sheets could have material pricing for the different conduits, EMT, rigid, MC cable, etc. And you can go into Red Rhino and change the prices to your prices. I'm going to show you how now. So from the home page here, go over on the right hand side, click on vendors, and you'll see the accordion menu open. Click on vendor catalog. Now when the screen opens here, let me open it here, you'll see one vendor in here called Generic Vendor. Now I don't think you can do this anymore, but people used to go change the name of Generic Vendor, and if you do that, <laughs> don't do it. If you do that, it doesn't allow us to go update your pricing. Okay, so just click on Gen Generic Vendor next, click on it, and you'll see it open up. Okay, now next you just want to click the Discount button up here. Click on Discount and you'll see it spin around there and open up a new window. What you'll want to do next is go locate the product that you want to update the price of. So what you do is you click this drop down, it says product category, select category, click this drop down right here. Now what you want to do is, or, or let me say it this way, the top items here are structured cabling products, products that we don't give pricing for. So what you want to do is scroll down about halfway and when you do, you're going to start looking for the conduits. Here we go, right here. Now look here, 4011 is EMT. I'm just going to kind of give you a brief overview of this. You see here, here's your metal clad cable, MC cable, that is. Hospital grade MC cable, EMT, GRC. This is your conduit group right across here. Now I'm just going to drill down into EMT. Let's say I got a pricing sheet from my wholesale house of my price for EMT conduit. I just click on this. And wait a couple seconds here, and it will display different prices. Now, let me just give a brief explanation of this. This is very simple. Once you've done this a few times, you'll fly through the process. But here, here is a story on this page. Down on the left-hand side here, we see a description of the products. Now, we're, we selected EMT, so it has half-inch, clear-through, four-inch. You'll see it listed on the left-hand side. Now, over on the right here, it has what's called the end column price here. Now, this is the actual price that gets adjusted. Then, so when I say that, I mean when they do their pricing updates by the fifth of the month electronically, these are the prices that get adjusted. Now, Red Rhino works in a system where they give a discount off of the price, the wholesale price. This in column price is a wholesale price. It gives a discount. And when you see the net price displayed here, this is the price that flows to an estimate. So if I went into an estimate right now and input some half-inch EMT, it would spit out the price of $19.11 per 100 feet right now. Okay, now you might see something different by the time you watch this video. I'm, I'm giving you a snapshot of what mine looks at at this second, okay? Now, so long story short, what you do is you just go in here and change the net price. That's all you do. Don't touch the discount. Change the net price to your cost. Let's say I pay $21 per hundred. I change it to 21. I don't need the point zero zero. I usually don't do that to put that in, but you can if you want. You could put in the pennies. Um, so. So you just simply go down here and you change the price of these items to what you pay. Okay, very simple. When you're all done, you have to save it. If you don't save, if you just navigate away, guess what? It won't save. Okay, so then just click the Save button. Okay, and when it stops spinning, you'll see it flash and it saved the pricing that I made a change on. Now, the other, the other thing that you need to be aware of is this unit of measure. Conduit is set up per 100 feet. That that uh, unit of measure is per C, Roman numeral 100, and so the price of the conduit shows $21 per 100 feet. Okay, hope that helps. Now, I'm just going to do one more thing. I'm going to click the drop down from here. You can just go on to the next item if you want to, if you want to uh, price the MC cable, you would select that, okay? 
uh, here's your Schedule 40 PVC and Schedule 80. Here's your PVC coated rigid, okay? So again, you just locate what you're looking for, just look through these items, and you go click on them to change the price. Now I'm just going down here slowly. Here's your aluminum wire, okay, or your bare copper wire. Okay, so we have uh, lots of different bare copper wires for grounding in there. Here's your SO cord. So again, what you do is you just drill down, find what you're looking for, click on it, it'll populate to this page, go down the net price and change the price to what your wholesale house says your price is, save it, and then when you go into your estimates then from then on, that's the price that you'll see. Okay, hope that video helps. Call us if you have questions.